Welcome back to Farming Simulator 2017 with the Rude Man. We are back on Maverick Farms, and this is the Seasons version. And so we're going to get back at it. We're getting close to harvest. If I run into the field here, you see we're at 71%. I was doing a little bit of, of uh, farm stuff while I was waiting for the crops to ripen so we could harvest. So let me show you what I've done. If you guys remember watching my videos I was a little frustrated with the fact that that I could not uh, use my course play route on this map and I'm not I'm not saying it's a map issue I think it's a mod conflict but let me show you what I've done I've tried every combination I could think of and then and then I ran up across this this is the road train set this is the road train truck and the rear trailer now if you remember in the road train set you've got this trailer here that's got this little bitty do built-in dolly thing this is a short trailer that hooks up to a second trailer this one can then hook up to a third and a fourth and whatever you can get that will that will pull it to make it a road train what I've done is I'm just using the truck the bigger truck here this one here I'm using that truck and this back trailer only and I've gotten it to work. So, um, now I like these trailers anyway, because if you remember, these are the trailers that have um, on the side of them, let's see, yeah, see the counter there? There's a counter there that tells you what's in the trailer. And is it on this side or only the one side? It might only be on the one side, but, it's the, but there's a counter there that tells you what's in the trailer uh, as far as weight. And then on the side, whatever goes in there, it puts a uh, puts a logo on the side as to what it is. So I like this trailer, and so I'm glad I finally got it to work. Now, as soon as I say that, it probably won't work, <laughs> but let's try it. Now, what we were having trouble with was this setting right here, uh, grain transport, and what it does is it loads at start. See, it says on the bottom there, type grain transport load at start. Okay, so what it does is it loads at the start, which is going to be this silo. I told it to go to the silo on farm number three and dump it and come back and get another load. It doesn't work. I couldn't get it to work. It would it would either, what, what it would do is it would start and then it would stop someplace out in the field and not go any further. Or it would go ahead and start cheese. Um, sorry. <laughs> It would go ahead and start, it would go to the other farm, it would dump the first load, it would come back for a second load, and it would just drive right through, like this. Let me show you. Instead of stopping to get a second load, it would go to the spot and it would just keep driving right through and not get anything. So I could, and then it would go to the other farm, it would go around in circles and never move anything. Now, I used different trucks, different trailers, several of them actually, um, I drew. I, I used trailers from a different mod. I used uh, tractor uh, trucks from a different mod. Of mod, several different variations. Couldn't get it to work. I don't know why. I happened to try this, but when I did, it worked. So let me let me go in here and see if I can find that route. This is kind of a mess. Pardon my mess. And I think it was this silo farm one to silo farm three. Let me grab that. And then I'm gonna move grass, I think. Let me see what I've got to move here. Okay, I've got a little bit of wheat, 12,000. Uh, I got lots of grass. I got a million 190,000 grass. So I wanna move the grass to the other farm. Why do I wanna do that? Because that's where the, um, that's where the animals need, because that, well, that's where the animals are. The sheep need grass. The silage makers over there, it needs grass. The cows need grass, so why is it on this farm? It shouldn't be. It should be on the other farm. So I'm going to move it. Now, let's see if I can do that. First of all, I need to come down here. Now that I've got that course set up, change it from wheat to grass. I'm going to tell it what I want it to get. And keep your fingers crossed, crossed this is going to work. There was grass right there. Okay, now let's go. Uh, let's go in here and drive the course. Okay, now this guy should come up here, stop, and pick up the grass. 
Watch it. I like these trailers. Watch this trailer here. When I start picking up grass. Grain transport. And it shows a picture of grass. And a sign. Grass transport. Did I say grain? Grass transport. And then look. The counter on the side of the trailer is filling up. Okay. Now that should work now. Let's get the other one. And double up on this. I don't know whether I'm keeping those other trucks or not since they're not working. Oops, I shut my truck down. Okay, so if I set this course also the same as the other one, these guys should just keep working until they get it done. So let's grab that course and let's spin this thing around. See if I can get him in line there and he should stop and wait. Okay, I'm going to leave those guys to, to do their job. In the meantime, i got to get this guy back out in the field. And I don't need... Uh, oh, he's already got course paper out doing. Why is this lights on? Is it dark? Am I losing daylight again? No, it's only 5 o'clock in the afternoon. Not losing daylight yet. But now what I'm going to do is I've been manually uh, picking this stuff up. Well, automatically picking it up, manually carrying it to the farm. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to carry it to farm three now instead of farm uh, one. Because yeah, that's where I need the grass. In the meantime, the uh, one guy's waiting for the other. Triaxle farm empty, waiting. Huh? What? That's not grass. Oh. I forgot. Sorry, my bad. When I set this up, I forgot to set it to grass. My bad. There it is. Okay, let's go dump this wheat. You know what? I can use wheat on the other farm. Let's go ahead and take it there. Because I need wheat for the mix uh, for the mixing station over there. I think pigs take wheat. I think, I think, I think. So I'll just go ahead and do this, and then hopefully on the next trek, he'll stop and get ga uh, grass. Get gas. He'll stop and get a bean burrito and have gas. All righty then. Let me see here. I think we're going to get uh, ready for this. Um, we're going to get ready for the next harvest, but in the meantime, I was doing this get, getting some pig food and stuff going here and it looks like uh, we got one more silo left now I showed these silos out in another episode might have been this one and um, I know a couple of you were confused because you didn't understand how it worked what you do is you buy what you're well basically what you're doing is you're buying let's see here okay what you're doing is you're buying, uh, it says 200,000, but it's not. You're buying 20,000 units of whatever, right? Okay, so we bought 20,000 units of uh, mixed rations. Okay, well, how do you get that? Well, you get that because what they do when you buy it is they put it in a silo for you. That way you can back your truck in, you can get your 20,000 uh, units of uh, mixed rations or pig food or whatever it is you bought and then as soon as the silos empty the silo disappears just consider it like a, a, a bag of fruit when the bags empty they fold the bag up and they put it in the storage somewhere okay so what happened was people were saying well hey when you uh, when you finished with your rig and pulled away that thing disappeared and they kind of thought maybe that was a game glitch no, it's because it's empty, and you have to buy another one. So as soon as you buy another twenty thousand, you'll get a, n a new silo. That's just how the uh, the mod works. And again, I don't think it's cheaty because you're actually buying the stuff, just like you would in real life if you drove to the grain store and bought seed. So anyway, there you go. That's kind of how that works. Sorry for the confusion. Might have been me. More than likely. Okay, Grasshopper's in the road, so... While he's waiting for the rest of his load, let's go check on 
this guy. Now, this is the guy that I was worried about. Where's the first one? All right. Now, let's see if this works. This is the guy's first trip back. He dumped his grass. And, uh, okay, another thing. See, see these railroad tracks here? You should be able to drive across these without any trouble. I was using that Mack truck from the uh, Mississippi map, and it was getting stuck on those railroad tracks. I couldn't use that truck on this map. It, and it's a lot smaller rig than this. Uh, physically. Physically, it's a lot smaller than this. I don't know if it's a scale issue with the mod, uh, but it's very, it's very, very small truck and trailer. I fooled myself there. I thought I was going to turn. I'm not driving this. Of course, play is, but I think when I recorded the route, I I thought I was going to turn there, so I slowed down, changed my mind at the last minute, took off again. Now, if we're lucky, this thing remembers that we wanted to get grass, and it's going to give me a second load. That's where it wasn't working before. Using this piece of equipment, it does work. So I'm thinking there's a mod. Uh, uh, there's a mod issue. Yep, there you go. It's getting your grass. When it's full, it'll take off, and it'll keep doing this until the silo's empty. Let's check the other guy. And I hope that since I've already changed this to grass that he remembers that and will pick up grass and not weed again because there isn't any weed I took it all it's empty now right well I'm gonna let him go he knows what he's doing hopefully uh... what else was I doing right I was gonna haul this stuff to the... did my silo go away? I see my silo's empty so it disappears that's normal <laughs> Take this to the other farm. I gotta, I gotta feed animals because I did buy animals. Did I not? I think I did. Is this the map I screwed up and bought double, double pigs? I may have to sell some pigs. I don't know if I can support that many pigs. I sold a couple tractors too that weren't working. So I gotta buy some new new tractors. Uh oh. Something's wrong. Something's wrong. Yeah, this guy he didn't remember. Okay, let me stop this. And uh, I'm gonna get rid of this course. I set it to grass, but it, then it, it switched back to wheat because because that's what it had in the trailer at the time. So I need to reset this, so let's do that. We're going to come back in and do that again, and then set it to grass. And this should work this time. Keep your fingers crossed. I never did check to see too. Did I change the color on the wording on this truck? Because it's uh, it's a darker color, so I needed a white uh, lettering. Did I? Did I? Did I? I sure did. Grass, it is. All right, back at it. So that's working now. As I normally say, cool beans. lovely day. This is, uh, I think, what, our last day of summer uh, in-game. And then uh, we'll be going into to uh, fall. Leaves will be turning. I'll do a fall harvest. Took three seasons to get a harvest going. Isn't that awful? That's terrible. Hurry up and wait. Hurry up and wait. That's me. I was hoping to get at least a couple harvests in. 
Um, I don't know. Let me not do this. Let me, let me, let me, let me. Did I feed the animals already? I better check that first. I can't remember. I don't recall. I think I did, but I had a very limited amount of food, didn't I? Okay, so let's go feed the animals. Let's see, we got a pig on the front. So let me drop this trailer and we'll go feed pigs first. And then we'll feed the... Uh, the uh, I might have been able to leave that trailer on, but it's easier to drive if it's not on. So let's see, where do we feed the animals? Is it on the inside? Look, they've already made poo. There it is. Feeding water on the inside. I really like when a mod, uh, when a mod author puts the a proper, a proper pen in for the pigs. You know, proper barn, instead of just those little Quonset huts outside. My pigs always stayed in a barn, came out into the field, into the uh, corral where I kept them. I like pigs, so I took care of pigs. Took care of my pigs. Alright, let me get rid of this. Whee! And I think this amount of food should get me through for a while until I can get some made. So I shouldn't have to buy any more uh, cattle and pig food. Uh-oh. Trouble. Sorry. I'm out of the way. I'm gone. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Let's see if I can feed the cattle without having to transfer it from the back trailer to the front trailer. Oh, by the way, I don't know if you guys noticed, but uh, it seems to me like in the, sea the l latest update to this, this got changed. Because I don't remember you being able to make silage from straw. So this is cool. You can now use grass, uh, dry grass, chaff, and straw to make silage. You know we're going to have a ton of straw when we start harvesting. And then over here, to make the compost... You can also use potatoes, sugar beets, wood chips, grass, windrow, silage, manure, chaff, and straw. Now, here's the thing. As I often said, I don't think I'm ever going to use potatoes and sugar beets and silage. Maybe manure, but I doubt it. I will use wood chips and straw and chaff to make compost, but I don't know if I'm going to use grass. It just depends. And I do have quite a bit of grass. Because I think if I've, yeah, I think I'm going to put a, uh, I'm going to put a uh, potato factory in. But here's the thing, though. The mod author John was in my live stream, and if you watch the live stream, you, you get, or you were in the live stream, you got to chat with John, the mod author, and he says the next update should have. Uh oh, totally is not accepted here. It must be inside. Um, he did say he's going to add a, a, quite a bit of production. So I'm going to wait until the next update and see what he puts in. But I've got a placeable sugar factory that I might put in for the sugar beets. We'll see what happens. Oh man, that's going to take a ton of food. Holy smokes! Maybe I lied. Oh, I've got 108 cattle already. I Oh my goodness. I might have to buy more food. I don't know because I don't have any made. Holy smokes. You cattle are pigs, man. And I won't even get any bacon. Look at the food they made. They're pigs and I, do, and I haven't even got any bacon out of them because they're not... Uh, producing bacon. They're cattle, silly cattle. They just think they're pigs. No, they really are pigs. Okay, so I gotta get going with the mixing stations. 
as soon as I get the right crops what do I need here I need silage do I have silage going no I do not I don't have any silage going do I have any silage made not on this particular farm I do not uh, right do you see silage wait a minute I got a hundred thousand silage um, mixing stations take two hundred thousand by the way so let's grab this truck here drop the trailer and like I said I'm kind of oh geez here he comes I'm gonna make him wait like I said I'm trying to do uh, make work until the crops are ready and all these things need to be done anyway right let's see silage no I want uh, uh, I want grass give me some grass Wow look how fast that filled up I like that that's that's cool man cool whip I like how you say cool whip okay reference to Stewie All right, so I can put. Uh, I'm going to do another hundred thousand of uh, silage, and then fill the silage part. And then also we need uh, grass, so let's do that too. I'm going to do that again. Give me some more. Thank you, sir. Okay, this thing holds eighty-two, I think. So let's see, eighty, eighty is a hundred and sixty. So I'll put 160 in here for now. That'll give me my second 100,000 for the mixing station. I'm looking at the, ca the counter over there. And 150, 162, okay, that's good. I only need 100, that'll give me a full, a full tank of gas over there. As you see, it looks like my trucks are working like they were meant to finally that was uh, that was a little frustrating uh oh oh no he's full I think those other trucks are a hundred thousand each so they've probably done at least uh, four runs that should be four hundred thousand oh I don't want to make compost no 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 I do not I do not I don't why have I got donut on the mine? All right, where's the grass on the end? For some reason, even when this thing is empty, it shows that there's grass in it. Isn't that weird? I've got one load in already of grass. There's two loads. That'll give me 160. And then uh, I don't, I don't have enough straw. I need to do a harvest. Okay, so that took that. Now we can put in a little bit more grass. Uh-oh. Good thing he's bringing grass for me. You know what? I was also I was going to look at a, any, any of the fields that I do not own and see if there's any ready to harvest. And then I gotta go over and start seeing what I need for the pigs. I'm gonna have to do harvest for the pigs though, I know. Alrighty, let's line this thing up. What's that gonna give me? Alright, there's my 200 right there and I got a little bit left over. We'll just take that over here and dump it in the silage maker. And start it working on some silage. Mmm, look at that steam. I love the smell of silage. Well, it was one of my favorite things when I was growing up. It, it always reminded me of uh, molasses. Smell a little bit. A little bit. 
Okay, so what do we got here? We've got what little bit of potatoes in there and what little bit of sunflowers and we need uh, wheat, barley, or maize. Now, we bought some, we brought some wheat over, did we not? So let's grab a load of wheat and we'll get some pig feet going. Let's head over to the wheat section. Wheat on aisle three. There we go. Not much, but it'll be enough to get a little bit started there. West, well, not much at all, is it? We're not going to get much pig food for that. All right, well, that'll start cooking there. And then uh, let's go with that. Let me run around and see what we have in fields that are sown. Uh, hang on, what am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Let's go to the fields. Uh, boy, look at all that feed. All right right here let's take a look at fruit types rye triticale spelt and millet millet so it's not showing me anything really wait a minute here we go uh four is potatoes and we already have some potatoes what did we need corn 21 20 let's go look at uh, field 21 and 20 that should be north Yeah, we. Uh, I, I think John had a pretty good time on my live stream. John is the author of this mod, this map. I think he had a pretty good time. He was chatting quite heavily with my, with my people in the live stream, and they were able to, uh, to tell him a few things that they found on the farm that he fixed, or is going to fix in the next update. And I think everybody had a good time. Let's see. Here's the corn. Uh, it's only okay, so it's only the same as mine. So again, I'm gonna if I'm gonna do any of this, I'm gonna have to do it in the next season. Yeah. All right, that doesn't do me any good. So okay, let's run around. I tell you what, before the harvest goes, though. <coughs> excuse me. Um, what's happening here? This guy is blocking the road. What's happening? This guy's blocking away. Okay, I want. Here's what I want. Oh, hey, I was doing some of this in the meantime too. I was doing a lot of little things, trying to catch up with with the waiting for the fields to grow. Um, I got some of this stuff. Where is my truck? Or do I even own one? Let's see. I'd see if I have the trailer first. I do not have the trailer. Yes, I do. I've got a trailer. So what's it hooked to then? Um, okay. Where's it at? Where is it at? Where am I at? Where am I at? Somebody was asking the other day where the pallet machine maker was. Right here, and if you see where we're at, let's see, we're, uh, okay, we're right by the silo number two, right by silo number two, and this is a pallet board factory, as well as this one. This is where you make your wood chips, right here. So you make wood chips, out of logs and you throw them in here and over here in there that's your fuel and then you get more logs and you drop some logs right here and you drop some logs right here and that'll start this factory will start making these pallet boards 
you need the pallet boards to make the pallets. And the question was, the, uh, where are, is the pallet making factory? It's right here. It's right here, this building right here. This big, long building. So and there's two sections in it. You put uh, pallet boards in here. No, wait, 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 I'm sorry. Put pallet boards in here, and pallets come out over here. And then you put pallet boards in here, and pallets come out. So you, have t you can have two batches going at once. And uh, you're going to need pallets for a lot of different things. You might as well start making them if you're going to do any of the production. But I can't find my tractor and trailer. There it is. It's got no truck on it. What's, what's he doing clear over here? What? You got a load of truck. Of uh... All right, let's go get a truck. Maybe I'll use one of these. And where was he? He was in field 10, maybe? West Mill? Where am I at? All right, I gotta go this way. I gotta go this way. Okay, we're gonna go straight into field 10. Maybe. Oh no, that's not right, is it? That's not right. I don't think that's right. I'm lost. I see that blue dot down there. I thought that was my trailer, but maybe it's not. That might be that might be the lawnmower. It is. That's just the lawnmower. Sorry, I'm in the wrong area. So I need to go where I need to go. There it is. Straight up. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I got some logs here to pick up. I don't know why I was cutting here. There it is, right there. It's yeller on the map. Well, I tell you what, my uh, my videos are getting banned for advertising left and right. You can't say anything. It's a it's a computer algorithm that is just looking for certain words. I think. And it doesn't know content, uh, context. So it, it doesn't know when you say something that the context is not, a, uh, uh, you know, it's not bad. I see, I almost said a word. That, oh, holy smokes. No. Will you flip over for me? Come on. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ramming speed. Oh, jeez. What do I got? This guy will do it. Anyway, you can say something in context and it doesn't care that it's not it's not bad. Now, what here's I'm trying to get away with not saying the word that it knows it's going to take my advertising away for. Um and I'm probably not going to do a very good job. You know that the English language has words that have more than one meaning. You can say a word that somebody would think is a bad word. And I'm not talking cursing. I'm talking uh, a word that somebody wouldn't like. And, uh, where am I? A and, then, and then the same word can be said, uh, and, and it has a completely different meaning. Well, the algorithm doesn't know that. You use the word, and it thinks it's bad, and you don't get advertising. Okay. Where did I flip this thing? There he is. Anyway, it's very frustrating. Very frustrating. You never know what to say. Anything you say, it's just not right. It just isn't right. 
And uh, I, I think I mentioned that... Oh, it worked. I think I mentioned that um, they said that you can, you can have it reviewed by a human being, but only if you're a big enough YouTube uh, page to, uh, to get a thousand views. Well, I was wrong because I, I know I talked to a YouTuber the other day that has over uh, you know has a, a half a million subscribers and he said he can't review most of his either and I said well it yeah but you you get more than a thousand views on your videos he says no you didn't read it right YouTube says a thousand views in in the first week that it's up and he said yes over a few weeks I'll get a thousand views out of 500 subscribe 5000 or 5 million or 500,000 subscribers but I rarely get a thousand views in the first week it's up so yeah they got you coming and going where was I going with this not there Oh, geez, did I really just do that? I'm stuck in a forest now. Okay, this is the rude man way. Oh, no. Oh, how am I going to get out of here? I'm going to get stuck for sure. And, uh, yeah, I know, I'm just whining away. Oh, no. Oh, I just made a mistake. No. Oh, so far, so good. Dang. Woo! I'm going to make it. Man, that was frightening, I'll tell you what. Okay, so first of all, oh, jeez. First of all, I'm going to need some logs for uh, wood chips. So let's go ahead and throw some of these in a wood chip or chip, chip, chip. I hate to put them all in there, but I don't know any way of stopping it. All right, let me see if I can just drop some of them. I don't know. It's going to be tricky. Uh, let's see here. We are on the left side. Start, unload, Z. But can I stop it is the question. If I just want to put some of them in, can I stop it? Yeah, I can. Okay, stop right there. I don't want to put them all in there. I want to put some here. All right, so now I've got logs there. That thing over there is going to make me some wood, wood chips. Hopefully. Hopefully. Is it already making wood chips and I just don't hear it? Wow, did it do it instantly? Because it's not running. That would be slick if that was the case. How does it do that? I swear this is going to be the last, uh, the last episode that I even mention YouTube because if I get if this one's banned, did did anybody watch that tutorial I did the other day on uh, on the uh, folder switcher? If you did, that episode was very very short, and I said absolutely nothing in it that could be construed as bad and I got banned because one word in the title because of one word in the title I can't put advertising on and I shouldn't say get banned it doesn't get banned I can still put it up I just don't get paid for anything alright let's see if we can pick this up here Uh oh, missed one. Missed that little sliver of a thing over there. You should have been watching the other day. I was playing uh, off camera, and <laughs> I was I was logging to beat the band. And uh oh, how come it didn't put? Hang on, start unload, stop on, stop auto load, put the straps on. There you go. I was. I was using this monster here and I was cutting trees to beat the band and I came up uh, see these lamp posts 
there were lamps supposed on the side of the field that I was working and and I'm cutting trees cutting trees up this way cutting trees and I kept trying to cut this thing and it wouldn't cut wouldn't cut and I said okay why won't it get th-? and I looked up it was a lamp post oh <laughs> uh, yeah you kind of had to be there <laughs> it was pretty funny though Okay, so we have wood chips. We've got logs on one side. Let's put logs on this side. I said logs. Let's put logs on this side here. On this machine. And I think it's still unloading on the left side. Take the straps off. And unload this thing. And there we go. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, now I just have to get the wood chips, so... I'm kind of running out of time here in this episode, but what I'm going to need is this truck right, right now. I need this truck over, over yonder. Where am I? I'm running. Oh my God! I just <laughs> nose dived into that silo. That was funny. Now my head feels. Weird. I think I left part of my hair in there. All right, let's see if I can get through these trees without crashing. I'm gonna go ahead and let those trucks run until they get all the grass taken over here because uh, I, I, I don't know of any reason I would need grass on that particular farm when all the animals are over on farm three. So I'll probably go ahead and transfer all of the uh, grass and probably I don't think I have any straw over there, but I'll leave some of the grains there and I'll use it for some of the grains around that particular farm. But where is, where am I? Uh, this way. No, oh, I'm kind of lost. Where am I? I'm really lost. All right, there's that guy. Okay, I know where I'm at now. So I'll probably keep that tractor, uh, the truck right there, and put it on the other flatbed truck that I need to haul the pallets around and straw bales and stuff like that. And I'll keep this truck here to run that logging truck, right, or that logging trailer right there. But let's grab a few of these wood chips over yonder. Gimme, gimme, gimme. It's going to take a while. Let me go check on those other trucks while I'm talking about them. So he's empty, and he's getting filled up, and let's see how much grass we got left. Oh, we're down to the last load. That's it. There are no more. And there's nothing else I need to transfer from this. Now, that's silo number two, and we got grass in there too. Um, I might just leave that. I might just leave that. Okay, but we can stop this other truck here that's empty. I'm just going to tell him to stop at the last trigger. And he'll stop there. And he'll block the way for the other guy. Oh, I need to buy a couple tractors too. Uh, tell you what though, I'll do that maybe in the next episode. Because I'm kind of running out of time here. We have all the chips that were made here. Uh, which wasn't that many. 17,500. Let me drop a few of them over in this one. Now, the interesting thing about this, you drop wood chips in there, and wood chips is your fuel. When you actually start working the logs to make pallets, 
it makes wood chips too, but it doesn't make as many as it uses. So eventually you're going to run out. All right, what's happening here? There it is. Find my trigger. Okay, don't put it all in there. No, no, I didn't mean to do that. Now I have to wait till it makes some. Darn it. Oh well, there you go. I'm going to go ahead and call it an episode here. Hope you had fun. If you did, give it a like. Share it with a friend. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you back on the farm in the next episode. Happy farming.